What's up nail friends and welcome to the vlog. Okay, so I have been working on my room quite a bit lately and I really wanna change this section over here. I think I want my gel polishes exposed. I have so many of them and they're taking up a lot of space in my drawers. So I've already organized these luckily by numbers. I think it's gonna look kinda cool in my background. I guess we'll see when I'm filming. Okay, so the next task on my to-do list today is film some mini clips for autumn designs. So I have some of my papers here and I have some ideas in mind. I've already prepped a bunch of my fingers and got them all ready to work on that. So I'll just show you guys me working on that because you guys won't see the video until fall, which won't be until September. So I'm just trying to get ahead on YouTube. Not really like ahead, but trying to get some filming done when I have spare time because I know I'm about to be insanely busy. So right now I have these fingers. I'm using the red iguana fingers. So I have a few different ones. So yeah, I just... I just use the fingers because they're easy to hold. I use the tips that they come with and I glue on with gel, the Opre Gel X tip. So I'm using size five, or no, size, sorry, size four of the Gel X fits the best in the fingers, in my opinion. Um, yeah, so I already had them all ready. So that's basically how I get started here. I just have everything ready to go before I do it. So I actually don't plan ahead my designs. I kind of just go with what I feel like. So the first set of design I wanted to do, I chose these two colors, which are rose wine and chameleon. And the reason I chose them is because I picked up my swatch stick and they were sitting next to each other. And I just thought they looked really nice together. And I think they look nice against the background I chose. So I like to change up my background for each, each one.
Okay, so I got all that filmed. It is so messy now. Ah! Um, I still don't know what this is going to look like as my background, so I really want to see that. I also have a package over here um, from Beanie Beauty Box that I wanted to check out. And I think there's some new stuff to swatch. Um, yeah, so I'm going to tidy this up again because it's so messy now. Since they're done by number, it'll be easy to figure out. Now, I think, I hope. <laughs> I'm just missing the base, which is somewhere on my desk over here. I should probably find that actually. Base. Yeah, so I like the way this is looking. Uh, and that was easy to organize again. So, yeah. I guess it's not that messy. <laughs> I need a better swatch stick organization spot. These are the nails I did. Okay, so I thought that that was going to look cooler than it looks. Maybe I should change this camera angle. Yeah, this doesn't look as cool as I thought it was going to look. I'm going to change my camera angle. Okay, that angle seems to be better because I think that looks a little better. What do you guys think? I was also thinking of getting those little like butterflies or nail tip things that you paint and you stick it on the front of the bottles here and then it would be really colorful. I don't know, just an idea. Plus, I should put something on the wall eventually, but I just haven't yet. Anyways, we have a package here from Beaming Beauty Box. So let's take a look. So, this is the new Luna collection. Um, it's a really cute package. <laughs> I like the, the way they packaged this. Look at that. Yeah, that's really cute. Look at all the, like, iridescent stuff inside. Really, really cute. Yeah, so I'm going to swatch these for you guys. Okay, so I knew I was getting these in into my collection. So I know a few people have already done videos on them, so I didn't watch their videos because I wanted to be um, kind of like surprise in person, you know? So I purposely avoided looking at what these look like. Okay, cute. So this one's called Nova, Cosmo, Moonbeam, Neptune, Aura, I think, and Eclipse. So that's really cute. I'm gonna zoom in a little. I like the packaging because, I don't know, it seems like it's going to spill less. I like the old packaging too. I don't really have a problem with the packaging. But this is what the packaging looks like now. I'll show you guys compared. I always keep the rose gold one right next to my desk because I use it so much. So this is the other packaging. So I don't know if they're just changing the packaging altogether or if it's just the one collection that they're changing. I'm not sure. It's going to be pretty. Okay, so this is what Eclipse looks like. Whoa, that is so pretty. Super concentrated. I really like these, these um, metal leaf gels because they're really great for like hand painting and stuff. And if you just want to like do a really quick set, like when I used to do clients, if they were late, if they came late to their appointment, we just did a Beamy Beauty box because it was so fast. I just do an acrylic backfill and then I would do Beamy Beauty box on top. So it's so super, super quick to do because of how high pigment it is. That's really pretty. So I'm just gonna swatch that for you. So I like to do like 
a thin coat down just to get the product down and I don't cure that and then you can just pick up some more and make it full full coverage because this won't wrinkle or anything wow okay so here's like another close-up of that so pretty and here's what that looks like cured So that was Eclipse. Now let's look at Moonbeam. I feel like this is something I'm definitely gonna like. Opening up gel is so messy. You guys, look at that. That's so pretty. So this needs to be stirred, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Wow, that is so pretty. Super, super pretty. That is so sparkly. This will be really, really beautiful for like wedding nails, New Year's nails. Wow, so sparkly. I like that one. So that one was called a moonbeam and that's cured. Wow. Okay, next one, let's go for Nova. Oh my gosh, it's like a pretty pink. Wow, that's, that is so pretty. Look at that. <laughs> that was a messy lid to get off. So I'm gonna stir this a little bit. So this is a pink tinted one. Super, super pretty. Sometimes I put a big blob at the top and then just kind of uh, float it down. So don't put a lot of pressure and just kind of float the product. So that's another way to do it. So either one thin coat and then build it up or a big bead of it in your, right here, and then float it down. Wow, so shiny. Okay, the next one. We have three more here. This is a small collection of six, which I think is perfect. Um, the next one is Cosmo. Wow, that's really, really pretty. It's almost like like a periwinkle. It's like a periwinkle metal leaf gel. I love periwinkles. Give it a stir. Ooh, pretty. Yeah, I like that one too. I like them all. They're glitter. I'm always gonna like them all. I don't think I've ever tried a Beamy Beauty Box um, glitter metal leaf gel and been like, ugly. <laughs> That's just not gonna happen. They're just too pretty. This one's called Neptune. I'm excited to see what this one looks like. I like that they've kind of like added the glitter into the, into this. Ooh, that's really pretty. Oh, sorry guys, I don't have any other words to say. Really pretty is my default. Wow, look at that. I like this one. Okay, so that's how it turned out. And then there's this one. I think it says A-U-R-A, -A, Aura, Aura. Wow, look at that. These are all beautiful. Clean that, whoops, a little stir. So you don't get a lot in these, like it looks like you don't get a lot, they're like five gram jars or something, but they last a long time. You, like they're super pigmented, you hardly need a lot. I've, I hardly went through these and I use them on my clients a lot. Back when I did nails on people. Ooh. So I'm gonna open them all up for you guys to see. So you can kind of see how they compare next to each other. I got, I got it all over the lid. Okay, so these are all six of them. Pretty collection. I really like them. Which one do you guys like the most in their jars? I don't know, they're all so pretty. I really like this one, I really like this one. I like them all. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know. 
This one's unique. That's why I think I really like this one. It reminds me of, like something you definitely could do a really pretty galaxy set with this one. I just like them all. So here they are. Which one is your favorite? I'm gonna pull this down here to show you. There you go. Which one do you guys like the most? <laughs> From looking at the swatch sticks. I like them a lot. I think they're so pretty. It's a great collection. Um, I do have a bunch of other stuff here I wanted to show you guys, but I feel like this video is going to be too long. I do have some new gels to swatch, some new ones to my collection from Glitter Bells, and acrylic that are new to my personal collection that I need to swatch. So if you guys are interested in watching more swatches, do you like me to include them into like vlogs like this, or would you like to see separate videos? Let me know down below. Hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, and if you subscribe, please click the bell next to it to be notified whenever I post. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!